Despite being 6'2 and proudly sporting purple hair, Michael Tatalovich, a freshman chemistry major at UT, seems like your average college kid. I really enjoy photography and um, playing volleyball when I have the chance, hanging out with lots of Netflix. <laughs> I love Netflix. But in May of 2013, Michael received the news that he was diagnosed with Ewing sarcoma, a rare type of bone and soft tissue cancer. Like, it seemed as if the world would just like like fell, that sounds so cliche, but it just seemed like the world like water fell, waterfalled in on itself. Due to his diagnosis, which would eventually lead to hip replacement surgery, dependency on a cane, and a year of chemotherapy, Michael hoped to document his journey through an art form consistent with the ways of the 21st century, Instagram. I wanted to, to make sure that other people could see what I was going through so that they could hopefully be inspired in their lives. Michael has received significant recognition for his bold efforts as he currently holds a follower count of over 23,000 people. But out of the 603 posts he's made thus far, this one remains his favorite. It's so raw and I showed it to my mom and she started crying. Even though she had seen me every day, she's like, Michael, you look so sick in this photo. I was like, mom, that's what I look like in, in real life. You know, it's, it's a chance for me to show what really goes on. I think that really like, was the essence of what I was trying to do with my Instagram. And through his courageous acts of expression, Michael has received numerous letters, messages, and comments from people asking for advice and searching for hope. People contact me that said, you know, I just went through this, or my mom, or you know, someone I know really closely just went through this, and it's, it's so inspiring to me, and it helped me so much. And so all of those stories of support that I could um, inadvertently affect, those just, you know, are and some amazing positives that outweigh the negatives, for sure. A diagnosis that once felt like the end of the world for Michael now serves as inspiration and encouragement for others, one double tap at a time. Hannah Evans, The Daily Texan.